program history, uh, was best start, first season here. What does that mean to you and the team? Yeah, we talked about it. So they had something to play for tonight, and they, they knew it was on the line. Obviously, it was um, in the press that we had matched the, the season best start. And so we wanted to be the team. We wanted to make history, and they did that tonight. So it's fantastic for uh, for the girls that, that had a chance to, to do this. Well, you made history, but you know, still only five games into the season. How do you and the team kind of look past that big milestone and really focus on what's up ahead? Yeah, right now we're going to enjoy this moment. We're going to enjoy this night, and then, we'll, of course, we'll regroup tomorrow and get ready for the next one. But, yeah, what a, what a moment for them, and they're, they're super excited about it. So we're going to let them enjoy this one. Huge save there at the end. I mean, absolutely right. huge, just to kind of solidify the game. Uh, what did uh, what did you say to her after the game or after that? Well, she, I mean, she gets the game ball. Our, our our team issues the game ball after every practice and after every game, and deservedly so. That's something that we work on. We focus a lot on set pieces, both attacking and defensive. And we talk about our post players and their role and how important it is. It's not just the kid who can't win a ball in the air. I mean, that role is critical, and obviously, she helped win the game for us with that save. I think tonight was uh, one of the latest times y'all were able to get on the board. Um, even though you did get the win, you know, what were some things that you think played into you know, not being able to get on the board a little bit sooner? I think it's because UMKC is a very good team. They're well coached. They're very organized. Uh, they're very good in possession. They did a fantastic job breaking our press, and so we had to change things tactically. And then defensively, uh, they had good numbers behind the ball, and their keeper was very good. So, you know, no, no shame in that, scoring late. Uh, they were very good. They limited us. I, I think that's the fewest shots we've had. But, you know, we had a couple quality ones, and we made the one count. So that's, that's what matters. Coach, how do you feel about the physicality of tonight's game and a lot of them being players? Yeah, it was. I mean, a physical game. That's, that's just soccer. Uh, really no different than some of the other matches we've played. Um, and our girls are pretty tough, and they're pretty resilient. So they get knocked around, and we knock players around. And it's just kind of part of it. So. No, no concern there. Uh, Zoe Jr., I think she got her third goal of the season. Pretty sure she leads the team. Any words on her and just how she's been doing uh, help with the offensive stuff for the team? Sure. She's created a lot of really, really good opportunities. And to score that one off a set piece, that was kind of something we hadn't worked on. But they, they uh, we saw kind of a, a hole in their wall, and we decided to basically call it an audible. And, uh, and it worked out. It, it worked out. She made a nice slashing run. Maya played her a great ball. And first time finished. So, yeah, so we stepped up big time. In the first five games of the year, y'all been pretty dominant in the possession side of the game. Uh, what do you think is that's the key to that? Well, we try to have a good combination of, of possession and, and getting forward quickly, and uh, I think we've been able to do that. There's been different games. Just depends on what our opponent presents to us and where the space is. You know, we played some teams where they, they play a high back line and they're spacing behind, so we're going to be a little more direct. And I think that uh, UMKC was a little more. Uh, with good numbers behind the ball and they dropped off. So, you know, we played a little bit more in the midfield and across our back line to try to open open up gaps. Two huge defensive plays for you tonight. Uh, kept them at zero on the scoreboard. Uh, how do you feel after a game like that? Oh, it's great. Um, honestly, it just goes back to what we do in the practice field. So preparing ourselves for these games, for these moments like that is just like what it comes down to. Uh, program record, first five games with a win. Uh, what does that mean to y'all guys? It means a lot, honestly. Like this, this is um, Steve's new era, so this is like our new era almost. So it's like just like a great opportunity for us to like really show like put Texas State back on the map, like, like let everyone know like this is our year, this is what we're here for to show like, hey, look, look at us, we're Texas State. So, yeah. uh, the offense of Texas State has been very electric pretty much all season so far. Um, how does that feel as a defender to, you know, really be able to have those girls in front of you who can make plays? Honestly, it, it shows up everywhere on the field, not even just our offense. Like, we're all working for each other, so it starts from our back line, then it goes into our midfield, then it goes into our forward. So we're all just out there working for each other, and that's what it comes down to. Okay, so, Coach, you got it. With the only success of this team, what do you attribute the best quality to y'all's uh, success in winning? Um, I think a lot of it has to do with our connection. Um, we're all like we're super close. We all spend a lot of time with each other, and we all know what we want at the end of the day. Like we want to win. We want to get a ring. We want to do all that. We want to have titles to our name. So with that mindset and all of us having that same mindset, that's just what like helps us get to these points. Yeah. You talk about these team accolades and everything, but you got the game ball today. What does that mean for you and uh, <laughs> and uh, just to be able to have that? Um, it means a lot. Honestly, it shows that my team is really back there supporting me, and they have my back and everything. And then. It's the same way for me, like I have their back, I'm supporting them. We all we're always there supporting each other and that's all that matters.